AVID will stand for Advancement via Individual Determination. And it's a class that really helps us get ready for college and get ready for what to expect in the real life. AVID is a, a class that helps you figure out what you want to do for the future and um, help you do better in all your classes. AVID is pretty much a way to help you get ready for college and help you gain skills that you need for your life. AVID is something that individually strengthens you and pushes you academically. For me, you know, that changed a lot of things. It showed me that I can do things that I didn't think I was going to be able to do. Um, I went from my grade point average being like a 2.5 to now I get 3.7, kind of around in that area. So it's definitely changed um, student-wise who I am. So. Before AVID, I, when I was a freshman, because I went into AVID in 10th, 10th grade, I really didn't care about school. I didn't really want to do my homework or, you know, you know talk to other people, be um, cooperating groups. So I was kind of a lazy, laid-back student who didn't take that many notes in class and didn't study often on my own time. I was very like unorganized and not very confident about who I was. And, like even student-wise, I wasn't very confident. I'd often not like put names on worksheets. I'd do them, um, just kind of things like that. I felt like I wasn't doing my best, and I could, I had more potential and. I guess I just didn't care about the classes because I thought, um, I don't know, it's just not worth it. Like, it wasn't my level. I was pretty lazy, I would say. My work ethic wasn't where it needed to be, and I just wasn't really doing what I needed to, to do in order to better myself. Yeah, I wasn't very engaged in, part in participating in class. School was definitely, like, difficult. I had trouble organizing things, and I had trouble getting things done and in on time and stuff like that. And I was always kind of like, I looked at uh, my future as a long-term thing. So like, it was just a ways away and it wouldn't come anytime soon and kind of bare minimum, things like that. So, yeah. I wasn't sure about my future. I knew that I should get some college because everyone goes to college. And about school, I was just like, you know, just going because you know I had to go to school. I didn't really pay attention to what I needed to be doing like at the moment to prepare for my future. And Abbott has really helped me in planning out and just being ready for what to expect and what I need to be doing. Now I'm more confident on what I want to be and the skills that I should gain and what and from what I've gained, I'm also more confident in those. And it's also helped me understand how college works and what I need to prepare for it. I started studying more. It had an impact on my grades. I started viewing school more. I started viewing as a as a priority instead of something that I should do. It impacted me positively by letting me wanting me to do good in my classes, not just, you know, getting the D because it's passing or, you know, achieving those good grades, having A's and B's, not just going for like what I can do, but going past what I can achieve. Because of AVID, I'm going to Winona and because of AVID, it helped me reach the grades to be able to, to be able to go to Winona. I'm actually going to Stout in Menominee, Wisconsin. Uh, I'm going to st er, uh, study applied mathematics and computer science. Go to college and also be in the Army Reserve. And I want to study physics just to like, advance. When I'm older, I want to help society. I want to either go into interpreting or nursing. Because those are um, two careers that I really enjoy. And I'm planning to go on to Riverland, uh, starting my generals, and then from there, pick one of those two as career options. Without AVID, I definitely wouldn't be where I'm at or going where I'm going. Um, my grades just wouldn't meet the requirements or anything like that. And it's definitely helped me out immensely. I wouldn't have like the expectations for myself that I do right now. They would be a lot lower, I think. I wouldn't be this confident uh, in what I would want to be because I wouldn't know, I wouldn't be this sure on what I want to be and how to do it. And yeah, and I wouldn't have any plans on how I would do it. Yeah. AVID matters because it helps a student not only progress and be 
better at school, but also in their um, daily life. They learn to be more organized, more um, active, more involved with things. And so AVID is a really good program because it helps you, you know, want to get out of your comfort zone. It gives students who want to succeed a chance to succeed. It's pretty much a toolbox that it gives kids the opportunity to do well in school. and it, like you get told, hey, study this or do homework on that, but you don't really get told how, and AVID tells you the how on how to do things like that. AVID class isn't just an ordinary class. It's kind of a family and how people treat each other in this classroom. It prepares people that don't really have the support of, like Elf Place, and it just helps you become more, like be better individually and just want to go out and do things because you want to do it and because it betters you. I think AVID's a great program. That's definitely changed who I am and um, I wish I could have done it sooner. So, yeah. I can do this interview now, not be nervous before. I've talked in front of the school board, you know, and wouldn't have been able, if you would have asked me I did, if I did that a couple years ago, I would have said no. But that's, <laughs> I would never do that, but now I've talked in front of audiences, talked about what is AVID exactly, so I would explain to them that it really helps um, a person, you know, be a better them and in every way.